10 Things You Didn't Know About Johan Rupert Johan Peter Rupert, born 1st June 1950, is a South African entrepreneur who is the elder son of business tycoon Anton Rupert and his wife Hubert. He is the chairman of the Swiss-based luxury goods company Richmond and the South Africa-based company Remgro. As of April 1, 2010, he assumed the CEO position of Compagnie Financière Richmond. Rupert and family were ranked as the second richest in South Africa on the 2021 Forbes list, with a fortune reported at 7.1 billion US dollars. For a man who keeps his personal life very private, it isn't easy to dig in and actually find out what his personal life details are all about. But in this video, we managed to go an extra mile and bring you 10 things you definitely did not know about the South African billionaire. Hello, explorers! Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Here are 10 things you probably did not know about Johan Rupert. Number 10. Rupert is a former cricketer. Rupert is a former cricketer and founded the Laurius Sport for Good Foundation in 1990. Laurius funds 65 projects globally with the goal of using sport to tackle social issues, having a particular emphasis on underprivileged children. He co-founded the Sports Science Institute with his friends Mon Duplessis and Tim Noakis. Rupert also developed the Gary Player Design Leopard Creek Golf Club in Pumalanga, South Africa, which is one of South Africa's top three gold courses, and rated number 25 outside the United States of America. He has also played in the annual Gary Player Invitational Golf Tournament to assist fellow South African and friend Gary Player raise funds for various children's charities. He serves as chairman of the South African PGA Tour and chairman of the South African Golf Development Board. In 2007, he was elected into South African Sports Hall of Fame and in 2009 was inducted into South African Golf Hall of Fame. Number 9. He dropped out of university. Rupert grew up in Stellenbosch, where he attended Paul Roos Gymnasium and the University of Stellenbosch, studying economics and company law. He dropped out of the university to pursue a career in business. However, in 2004, the university awarded him an honorary doctorate in economics. Number 8. Antisocial Described as reclusive by the Financial Times and Barons, Rupert rarely gives interviews and shuns public events. Well, this should be most obvious and of course can't be exempted from our list. Number 7. Rupert is also a committed conservationist. Following in the footsteps of his father, Anton, Johan Rupert is also a committed conservationist. In addition to conserving about 25,000 hectares in the Graf Reinitz area, he is also chairman of the Peace Parks Foundation. Number 6. Did you know Rupert controls the world's largest luxury watchmaker? Well, now you know. Rupert controls the world's largest luxury watchmaker, CA Financier Richmond, through a family trust. The Bellevue. Switzerland-based companies' brands include Jaeger Le Coultre and Cartier. His other holdings include Remgro, a Stellenbosch South African-based investment vehicle with stakes in more than 30 companies. Number 5. Rupert owns an amazing car museum. Franschhoek Motor Museum is a must-see South African venue, showcasing over a hundred years of automotive history it caters to tourists, local families, and moto enthusiasts alike. The museum's collection exceeds 220 vehicles, such as the 1899 Beeston Motor Tricycle, with more than 80 exhibits that are available to view at any one time. 
displayed in 4 dehumidified halls with a total floor area of 2,700 square meters and presented in chronological order. With a unique and exciting collection of vehicles, motorcycles, bicycles and memorabilia, in the magnificent setting of Law Marine's Franchuk, you can book a museum tour, have a snack at the deli, or take a tram ride to Anton Rupert Wines for a wine tasting. Number 4. Did you know Rupert's wife is a racehorse breeder? Johan is married with Keith. His wife is known as Gaynor Rupert. She is a breeder of race horses, something that her husband talked her into doing. She also manages their Drakenstein farm. The couple is blessed with three children, a son named Anton Rupert Jr. and two daughters named Carolyn Rupert and Haneli Rupert. Not much is known about the kids except the occasional publications on the son, Anton Rupert Jr., who is named after the grandfather and founder of their business empire. Number 3. Johan Rupert's Golf Estate Rupert, one of South Africa's richest people, owns the prestigious Leopard Creek Golf Estate, situated along the Crocodile River near the Kruger National Park in Malalani. The estate has 271 residences, along with recreational facilities and an 18-hole golf course with a clubhouse. The golf course is known for hosting the annual multi-million rand Alfred Dunhill Championship, which attracts the best professional golfers from all over the world. Number 2. Rupert is a golf lover and player Rupert's love for golf cannot be overemphasized. It is said that he plays golf at least twice a week and about four times when playing with friends. Number 1. Rupert succeeded the Law Marines estate from his father. Situated in the Frankshock area, this is the main estate in the Anthony Rupert wine portfolio. It houses nine vineyards, namely Syrah, Chardonnay, Pinot Grigio, Pinot Noir, Pinot Verdot, Merlot, Sauvignon Blanc, Carbonet Sauvignon, and Carbonet Franc. But it is not just the wine profile that will astound you. It's what's inside the estate that is quite remarkable. Near the entrance of the property, this tasting room offers a relaxed and indulgent experience of the Italian-inspired Terra del Capo Ranch. You'll have a bird's eye view of the activities in the cella through a clear glass wall and a picturesque view of the mountains. There is also an antipasti bar, which is perfect for a quick lunch or to discover some pairings. There you have it, the explorers. 10 things you didn't know about Johan Rupert, South Africa's richest man. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and make sure to leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and share with a friend.